There's been much debate over the weapons and supplies the U.S. has sent to Ukraine. But we're learning more about a secretive pipeline of arms being delivered to our ally in the Middle East. The U.S. has significantly increased its military support to Israel, delivering at least 23,000 precision guided munitions, among other weapons, through over 100 separate transfers. Of these, the administration officially notified Congress about only two, utilizing an emergency rule to circumvent the standard review process for these cases. That's according to the Wall Street Journal. The remaining arms transfers were authorized through quieter methods, including tapping into U.S. stockpiles, fast-tracking prior approvals, and dispatching smaller shipments that don't trigger the need for congressional notification. The approach to U.S. weapons shipments to Israel starkly contrasts with its transparent military support for Ukraine, where details on arms supplied and total assistance are openly shared by the Defense Department. Critics, particularly within the Democratic Party, are urging the administration to use U.S. military support as leverage to encourage Israel to facilitate humanitarian aid access to Gaza. State Department officials report 600 active potential military sales or transfers worth more than $23 billion between the U.S. and Israel. Senators have expressed frustration over the administration's hesitancy to exert its influence, advocating for conditional military assistance to ensure the delivery of essential supplies to Gaza civilians. Amidst discussions on using laws like the Arms Export Control Act to potentially halt further weapons sales if Israel doesn't improve humanitarian conditions, President Biden has announced a plan to construct a temporary port off Gaza's coast. This initiative aims to streamline the delivery of humanitarian aid directly to the region as reports of critical shortages of food, water and medicine, with the conflict displacing most of Gaza's 2.3 million residents.